All you need to go to uh, Adobe Firefly, that's A-D-O-B-E, Firefly, uh, Fire and Fly, two separate words after it, but together, no space between them. Uh, do that on Google, and then you need to sign in. So you sign in with your Scotch account, as you can see here, um, I'm signed in with my Scotch account. Okay, when you scroll down, you should see something called Generative Fill here. If you click Generate, okay, it's going to ask you to upload an image. So I've already got an image of Peruna um, on the desktop. You can use any sort of image like this. Uh, it's good to use an image of sort of a landscape sort of image or a building image, something that's got some sky or some land or something that you can change. And it needs to be a substantial amount. Like, for instance, if I tried to do something in these little windows, I'd find it quite difficult. I might get away with doing something in the big windows. Okay, so when we're here... I'm going to start using this tool here to just to delete things. Don't worry about getting it perfect. I'm just rubbing things out and try not to rub out uh, the building. So try to uh, avoid doing that. Okay, so if you notice, that's quite rough there. I haven't got too close there. And then I'm going to describe what I want in there. So I'm going to do um, starry sky um, with a large moon. Okay, and click generate. Okay, and what it's doing now is it's generating um, something that's going to go in that gap that I've left. So wherever you rub something out, it's going to try and um, generate something to go in there. Okay, so there it goes. Not really brilliant on the on the um, on the stars, but it's stuck a moon in the corner. Okay, there's another option. Oh, well, I don't know what this is here, but there you go. And I can decide which of those to keep. Or I can try again. So I'll just go keep on that there. And then I could do something else on the rest of this here. So down here I could get rid of uh, some of the path down there. And then try to um, have something fill in this gap down here. So I could go, okay then. Um, beach, sand with waves. And click generate again. And let's see if it'll do this one. Okay, so it's generating now, and we should come up with something quite sh uh, soon. So, generating just, it may take a while with a few of you on there, it may take uh, longer than you think. And there we are, we've got some sort of beach scene there. Oh, it's put some chairs there, that's a bit weird. Oh, there is my little bit of waves, so I'll do that. They look like waves anyway. Okay, so that's the idea. Once you've finished, you can download. This is a JPEG, and that will be what goes on your homepage. It doesn't have to be um, Peruna or Scotch Buildings. They're just something you could use. But try and get something, as I say, where you've got some chance of doing quite a big area and changing that. So that's a way of using Generative Fill, and this is using AI to, uh, to make that happen. And Adobe Firefly is an easy way to do this. Thank you.